conduct speaking mock test of student from Haryana. He is Rahul from Kethal. So we are going to conduct his speaking part 2 and part 3. And I will give him direct feedback in this session only. Okay? Alright, Rahul, your topic is talk about something you like to do after coming from school or work. As you are a student, of course, you can talk about that. What is it? Where do you do that activity? How long do you do it? And explain why you like this activity. You have one minute. Here is your cue card and paper. As you can see, Rahul is making notes. So some people have this myth that we are not supposed to write anything on the paper given or we should not prepare in front of examiner. This is very wrong. This paper is for you. You can note down the main points and you can speak on those points while speaking for cue card. And you can speak on those points in your cue card session. It's a wrong perception that the student who does not write anything or does not prepare in front of examiner on sheet, they score more. This is very wrong. You can write, you can prepare. Yes, we discourage you to write full topic that you start writing total story. But main points you must write. Are you ready Rahul? Yes, Please start. That different type of activity which I usually do whenever I came back from my school. But today I want to talk about my personal favorite activity. So I like to do exercise whenever I came back from my school. I just go to stadium. It was almost two kilometers away from my home. I, uh, I do some stretching as well as some yoga there. And I also lose some weight from these exercise. When I was in class 11th, my weight, my weight was 89. But now my weight was 75. So mm -hmm. I feel very good and aesthetic. So I usually perform my exercise with my friend and my neighbor because it also helped me because they are very good in body figure so they also help me to do good uh, yoga and uh, it also help me and I usually do 45 minutes to 1 hour exercise because this I, perf I consider that this is the ample of time to perform any exercise and after doing exercise I feel very confident as well as very energetic so after coming back from school I perform these exercises, this, this activity. Okay, well tried. Right. Uh, you were talking about any activity you do and uh, sometime you used past tense. Like I came back, you should say I come I back from school. school. Then you said my weight was this and now your weight is 70 something. It is not was because you are talking about present. Yes, sir. And you said I have lost, you can say ways. Weight, sorry, I have lost weight. Okay. Overall, it was good, but you should speak more. It was less than two minutes. Try to speak. Don't repeat it, and you can talk about like how you do this activity and why every day it is important for you to do this activity. Fine. Otherwise, well tried, not bad. Okay. All right. In part three, I am asking you few questions related to this topic. Okay. What activities do people like to do in the free time? People like to do different type of activities in their leisure time. Usually people like to use phone or they always, many of people always scroll their Insta or WhatsApp in their leisure time. Do people prefer indoor or outdoor activities in their free time? It depends on their mood, which type of activities they prefer. But if I talk about my exam, if I take my example, I usually do outdoor activities in my leisure time. Do you prefer indoor or outdoor activities? I prefer to do outdoor activities. Like Why? Because it also helps me to lose my weight and it also good for stretching. I like to play badminton in my leisure time and I also was a state player. What are the benefits of outdoor activities? There are many activities uh, for after doing for there are many benefits of doing outdoor activities like it also helps you towards your body fitness as well as you may feel more confident after doing outdoor activities and you also lose your weight and make your body good make your body good bit better it keeps you fit it keeps you fit. right yes. and 
it saves you from various diseases. When we are fit, of course, we are mentally and physically fit. What skills can be developed in group tasks? I consider that there are many skills we can develop from group, group tasks like communication skills as well as listening and time management and teamwork. So after doing group tasks, we can easily develop our skills, these type of skills. Very good. Rahul, you can speak more in the follow-up. Like in last question, we can talk about like group in group activities. We learn team spirit. We learn how to handle others. And in the society also we have to live with others. So these things we learn by group tasks or group games. Okay. okay? Very nice. Well tried. Keep it up. Okay? This is the end of your speaking. Thank you.